Today's lesson is about responsibility and stewardship. From Luke chapter 16, it reads, If you've not been trustworthy in the handling of worldly wealth, who will trust you with the true riches? And if you've not been trustworthy with someone else's property, who will give you property of your own? And now let's look at what should we do from Luke chapter 3. As he was baptizing, John answered them, Anyone who has two shirts should share with the one who has none, and anyone who has food should do the same. When the tax collectors came to be baptized, Teacher, they asked, what should we do? Don't collect any more taxes than you're required to, he told them. Then some soldiers asked him, and what should we do? And he replied, don't extort money and don't accuse people falsely. and Be content with your pay. Was Matthew among those saying, what should we do here? Maybe God knew that our now converted tax collector was the perfect pick to record Christ's powerful exhortations in Matthew 24 and 25, the ultimate goal he has in mind for us to hear and do. His master said to him, well done, good and faithful servant. You've been faithful over a little. I will set you over much. Enter into the joy of your master. So how in the world can we get there? As the people coming out of the Jordan confessed, what shall we do? Sharing this teaching and mysteries of how to get where Christ wants us to be is stated in this verse. The most important part is, are you willing to accept and do it? Are you willing to become a steward?